the most emotional thing, um, well, there's been a few. Um, at the top of the list has to be uh, from a few years ago, uh, reunion of old friends, uh, big celebration at the pub. And uh, one of the girls comes over to me, old friend of mine, always been quite shy, we'd always sort of fancied each other a little bit. Um, and she brings me a drink over and, you know, we talk for a little while. And then just out of the blue, she says, we've never loved each other at the same time. <laughs> what do you say to that? Um, and she was calm when she said it, but it was emotional. Second most emotional, my mate came over to me, told me he loved me and spilled a pint on my shoes. So I'm pretty happy with the top choice for that one. So this guy, this idiot that I know, um, who I love dearly, uh, we're down the pub, it's middle of the week after work, and he freezes up. He says, uh, "Can you can you swap jackets with me?" What? Can you can you swap jackets with me? Why do you want me to swap jackets with you, Terence? Look, my um, my ex is over there. Okay. Well, I don't want to know it's me. Brilliant. And we were two drinks in at this point. We weren't even drunk, but it made me laugh. And I swapped, jack I swapped jackets with him and uh, he was suddenly just completely at ease. His ex came over and said hello, but yeah, it just made me laugh. Can you swap jackets with me? Yeah, cheers. Three of us were out, three guys, and um, one of us went to the toilet and me and this other guy were left there. Half an hour later, he comes back, and we've been a little bit worried, you know, should we go and, should we go and see if he's all right? You know, mm, it's not good. And we were like, yeah, are you, uh, you okay? He's like, yeah, yeah, no, fine. Right, we were just a bit worried because you, you, you've you been in the toilet for, uh, for half an hour. And he said, yeah, I've, I've been sending emails. You what? Yeah, I've been sending emails, I'm just in the toilet, just thought I'd catch up on my correspondence. That's not me exaggerating either. He said, I've been catching up on my correspondence. I don't think he was trying to be funny. It was very odd. What have I missed? Uh, everything. <laughs> I've missed, uh, I know it's really simple, but I've missed people. I've missed being able to go out without thinking about it. You know, I've, been, I've missed just being able to go to the pub and feel safe and confident about it. You know, we've got this framework around it now, this fear around it that, that wasn't there before. And I miss the simplicity of being able to go, we'll go to the pub, the pub's a happy place, let's go and have a drink and put the world to rights. I miss that.